lion. He just wanted to play his French horn. Mugging the lady. Welcome back, my little terrors. Today with me I have my mother. She has made some appearances in my videos. She went to Five Below, the greatest store on the planet, and got a book where you write a story and it gives you ideas for stories and words and stuff. So we're gonna make a challenge out of it because that's what we always do. I'm gonna tell her to tell me when to stop flipping and then whatever we land on, we have to write about it and it gives us suggested words to write with. And on the clock, we have 15 minutes. So we have 15 minutes to write a short story and then you get to vote which one you like best. So let's get started. Gonna flip through. Stop. Let's see this one. Okay. This one? The main character witnesses a crime. The words we have to use, Christmas, almond, paisley, lion, pipe. Sweet, safe, fresh horn, and plate a meat. We are done with our stories with a minute 35 left to spare. Guests read their stories first. No. It's rock, paper, scissors. Two out of two. Rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors. Rock, paper, scissors. Rock. Okay, you go first. What's the point of that? You won. What is your crime about? There was no crime. What? It's a twist. A twist. Cross a word emphasizes. Okay. I'm trying to remember. I did not expect to start my Christmas with a terrified scream, but that's what woke me from a dead sleep at 12.01 Christmas morning. I ran out of my apartment door in my paisley pajamas and my nightcap, and what to my wondering eyes should appear but a lion roaring at a woman in a maple tree maple tree. She was so scared she was about to fade from consciousness, so I had to act quickly. I grabbed a steel pipe from a construction area nearby and tried to approach the tiger. Tiger. Lion. I meant lion. I tried to approach the lion as quietly as possible. As I lifted the pipe to swing at the lion's head, he quickly turned and swatted it down the street like a child with a ball. There is no need for violence, he said calmly. All I wanted was to play my French horn. <laughs> but why did you chase her up a tree? Chase, he asked. Why no, she saw me and ran. I simply followed to explain to her I meant no harm, but she refuses to listen. We both looked up at the woman who was staring in puzzlement at us. Are you talking to it? Well, yes, I said, didn't you hear us? All I heard is roaring and growling, she exclaimed. What is going on? It was then that I learned I could apparently speak lion. After she climbed down and ran away as fast as she could, Douglas the lion and I got to know each other over almond cookies around the inflated holiday lawn ornaments. No pets are allowed in my building. Merry Christmas to me. The lion mugging the lady. That's the title. He, was, he said he was mugging her. The lion. He just wanted to play his French horn. Mugging the lady. Done. Beat that. I probably won't. It was an ordinary day in my New York apartment, if you could even call it an apartment. I prefer the term shoebox. It was November 22nd, my birthday, the big two five. And I've always, I always watch Christmas movies on my birthday. But today something smelled odd and it wasn't my cinnamon almond candle. The French horn playing from the TV faded as I made my way to the door. The green paisley carpet in the hallway repulsed me, and it didn't help that pipes were sticking out of the wall. It's much prettier outside, though. The building that screamed, get out now, before I collapse, you know? There was an inflated lion atop a marble fountain with a tall maple tree overhead. That's when I heard it. Blaring alarm systems coming from the nearest bank. 
Here we go again. Another robbery. They should really get a better system. My thoughts were cut off. Run! I heard a civilian scream. But me being me, I just stood there and froze, while everything around me turned to a rubble with one single boom. You witnessed a bank explosion? Yes. Okay, guys, that was it for our stories. Comment down below who you think story was better. Honest thoughts, honest opinions. It's all happy, fun time here. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you want to see next. See you later. Peace out. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs>